Hi there! So, you probably just got Dying Light 2, and now you're wondering, how the hell do I get my hands on that grappling hook and that paraglider? Those tools look like so much fun, I just want to get my hands on them as soon as possible. Trust me, I hear you. They're amazing. They're a lot of fun to use. When I loaded up the game for the first time, it's the only thing that I wanted to do, so I understand where you're at. But let me go ahead and just jump right into it. I know why you're here. So let's start out with the paraglider. So the paraglider is given to you roughly three to four hours into the story of Dying Light 2. During the quest, A Place to Call Home, the character Lawan will give it to you. Y you can't miss it. It's given to you as a story item, and you keep it for the rest of the game. They do a very brief tutorial for you and then you are free to go and use the paraglider whenever and however you like. I can understand the frustration behind some of these items being locked behind story progression. Trust me, I do understand. But don't worry, it gets worse because the grappling hook is also locked behind story progression. But this one is actually much further on into the story rather than three to four hours. I will say that it'll take you around eight to 15 hours of playtime to get the grappling hook in Dying Light 2. I know that in the original Dying Light, it was unlockable as a skill that is completely gone. You need to progress into the story and then you will be able to get it. Now I say eight to 15 hours because it all depends on how quickly you progress through the main story. If you take your time like I did, it took me roughly 15 hours. If you're like my friend who just speed ran through it, it took him about eight to get there. But just keep playing, you'll unlock it, don't worry. You unlock it during a story mission called to broadcast and now I'm not gonna say any more I'm gonna give you five seconds to click off this video if you don't want to hear spoilers they are very minor but I'm just double checking with you so five four three two one okay you've been warned so during broadcast at one point during the mission Frank will hop on the radio and he will guide you to the grappling hook. You basically go and use this to help climb up a big building, and then you go and get a nice, pretty awesome cutscene right after, too. Yeah, Frank, I think I found it. What's it for? It's a grappling hook, a rope launcher. So what? We'll help you climb. Aim it at something it can attach to, and shoot. Try to use it to get onto the terrace. Let me know once you've done it. Okay. But from here, once you do complete the mission, you are free to use these tools however you want. It makes traveling through the world like a thousand times more efficient and more importantly, more enjoyable. So do get your hands on it. When it comes to the grappling hook, one thing to note is that it does need to be in your equipment slot. As with the paraglider, it doesn't need to be. The paraglider is always one click away. So when you want to use the grappling hook, make sure it is equipped in the correct slot. But anyways, that is all that I have for you guys today. If you did enjoy, please like, subscribe. Thank you, Justin Floor, Swift, Decent, and Storing Warhog for being my true Patreons and Ultimate Champions. With all that said, that wraps up this video. Thanks, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.